joining us tonight for an interaction is the Minister for State for Law and Parliamentary Affairs uh, in Mizoram. Thank you so much for your time, sir. I just want to start by asking you, we have seen in the past six days escalation. We have seen in the past six days very strong attack on both sides of the border. And now this unprecedented move in which you filed a case against the chief minister altogether. People would say that you are not making any attempt at this point to try and curb tensions. Hello, pardon? The last, the last sentence, please. Sir, can Hello? you hear me now? The last sentence. I can hear... Sir, I want I to understand... I want to understand what the government of Mizoram has done so far to de-escalate tensions. Uh, yes. Uh, regarding the de-escalation, uh, we are trying to, we are a peace state under the leadership of our Honorable Chief Minister, Puzoram Tanga. Uh, we are trying to uh, dissolve this uh, dispute between the Assam and Mizoram. Uh, with uh, with a table to st uh, sit How at the exactly? table, and we are proposing uh, for that with uh, with peacefully and without violence. So you're saying you're trying to resolve the issue, but what we see from your side is a very sort of provocative FIR. How is that de-escalation? That escalation, that uh, FIR. Uh, is for finding out uh, uh, justice what uh, allegation is in both sides should be uh, find out from the justice we are find we are asking we are seeking a uh, justice so can i ask you this now because i'm hearing a lot of diplomatic responses from you i'm going to be very candid about that i want to understand from you what has Mizoram done so far since in the past six days that you can say that you've done your bit you have tried to de-escalate issues and tensions from your side yes we are trying to de-escalation uh, that uh, now also go ahead sir we can hear you go ahead yeah yeah peace peacekeeping then here also we are maintaining peace in Mizoram and as well as the outside our neighbor state and within the Mizoram also the non Mizo people who are also staying there are happy here in Mizoram we are not uh, disturb them we are not uh, uh, we are not uh, giving any problem so but we are help them and the stranded people who are driver and handyman are also uh, giving their fruits here in Mizoram for the help of them for the for making them happy here in Mizoram right sir but what about your political allies on the other side of the border what have you done to try and resolve issues with them yes we, we have tried many times uh, since the government of India under the chairmanship of honorable uh, home in, union home minister uh, the leadership and the chief chief ministers, honorable chief minister, both side and not the chief minister, are discussing about the boundary dispute and uh, boundary They are dispute. discussing. You say, you saying they are yeah, in they, conversation with each other and they are talking because what we are yes, seeing are is talking. FIR, a case of attempt to yes, murder against the chief that's minister. True. That that is that is the consequence upon the uh, ex, uh, illegal action done by the uh, Assam. Uh, that is the consequence. FIR is the consequence of the uh, illegal action done by Assam. But you've named the chief minister, you've named the IG, the DIG, 200 other officials in that? People would yes. take this as very provocative. Yes, that is. Uh, we are provoking them because actually uh, they, they are, they, because of their uh, order that, uh, that uh, avoidable incident was happened so the justice should be fine uh, with uh, fine by the law from the law we are finding out we are trying to finding out the justice 
Okay, let me get a response from you. The Assam Chief Minister now says that he is happy to join the pro, but he will only do so that unless it is done by a central agency. Is that something which will be okay with Mizoram? That's okay. Uh, we are op we are open. We, we are still open uh, fr from the beginning, uh, before the fire was uh, uh, started by the Assam. Also, we are uh, we are. Uh, silent on on the boundary issue, uh, but uh, and our resilience is knock, uh, knocking the, knocking open now. So I'm trying so to that, understand from you, sir. Mm. Would you would Mizoram be okay with a central agency doing a probe in this matter? Is that something yes, acceptable? Okay. Yes, it it will be acceptable. That that the the truth is acceptable. If the if, if the if they are conducting with the truth with, without bias. We are accept. All right. My last question to you, sir. Uh, this is happening against a chief minister who was said to be one person who really stitched together an alliance in the northeast. Himanta Biswa Sarma was once seen as the person who stitched together so many alliances in the northeast that led to the present governments being formed there. A probe like this, an FR like this against him. Yes. What does it say about? how things are unfolding in the northeast that is that the fault is <laughs> the fault is very clear that uh, the innocent people are fired by the uh, assam first so the uh, the innocent people the innocent civilian are fired by the uh, by, by the assam government led by the led by their chief minister and igp and all others so that uh, they, that political things is different on this criminal action, illegal action done by the Assam. All right, sir. Thank you so much for joining us tonight and uh, giving your thoughts. Uh, but that is the Minister for State for Law in Mizoram saying that he is also okay to have a central agency actually probe this entire matter and get to the root cause of what exactly unfolded exactly six days ago and who stands at fault over here.